You've probably heard me share countless stories on how to recruit top producing sales stars. You know that top 20 that brings in 80% of all your revenue? Well, what I'd like to do is share with you something I picked up, oh geez, it was two decades ago this month, the power of the middle 70. Now, the story goes like this. <laughs> His name was Michael. I called him Michael the Machine Rubin because he was such a machine. Meaning prior to Michael, I would recruit really talented people, witty, nimble. So when I gave them scripts to say things like, you know, uh, make sure to build value here, create desire at this element. I could just do bullet points and suggestion and power phrases and they would do just fine. But when it came to Michael, he would literally read to the prospects the word. Make sure to build value here, insert name. I'm not kidding. Like he was that literal. It was such a, a detailed oriented cat. He was interesting. And my late partner, he told me, he goes, listen, he'll never be your top producer, but he'll never be your lowest producer either. There's value in having a machine. And that's why I call Michael the Machine Rubin. He wrote a book. It was called The Ultimate Sales Machine. He was a big fan of machines. And uh, Michael was the epitome of a machine. So you know what it did? It forced me to be specific. It forced me to think through every scenario. And it, it allowed me to build systems in place that when we cracked our marketing code, well, we could hire 10 salespeople a week now because I had every little minutia thought through to where it could be systematized and duplicated quickly. We truly could scale and double sales year after year because Michael the machine. So right now, with times changing economically, inflation, whatever it may be, there's pressure across the board for everyone right now. Have you taken the time to reinforce your machine-like systems that can guarantee that even the lowest paid common denominator staff member can allow you to maintain your profits? If you have that, you could... Uh, ride this wave or uh, ride out the storm. If not, wouldn't it now be the time to lean in? Comment, reply if you need any assistance on that. Otherwise, I'll see you on the inside.